Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. Prince George has been pictured alongside his dad, Prince William, at the Euro 2024 final between England and Spain tonight. The 10-year-old was seen in the stands at the Olympia Stadium in Berlin, Germany, for the showdown. Dressed in an identical suit to his father, he sang the national anthem next to Prime Minister Sir Keir Starmer. Follow usnews.company UK's live blog for coverage of England vs Spain in the Euro 2024 final. It marks George's latest outing in a spree of recent public appearances as the three Lions aim to bring football home for the first time in 58 years. He also cracked a smile as he shared a few words with the PM. This isn't the first time he's cheered on England at a Euros final having also been spotted celebrating wildly when Luke Shaw scored against Italy in Euro 2020. On that occasion, he was attending alongside both William and his mum Kate Middleton. However, the Princess of Wales was on royal duties for only the second time since her cancer diagnosis as she presented the trophy at the Wimbledon men's tennis final earlier. George's busy recent calendar included meeting Taylor Swift at her concert at Wembley Stadium at the end of June. The prince and his sister, Princess Charlotte, 9, joined William in smiling for a backstage selfie with the U.S. singer to celebrate their father's 42nd birthday. Swift's boyfriend, American footballer Travis Kelsey, said the royal children were an absolute delight. Only a week earlier, the young prince joined other members of the royal family on the balcony of Buckingham Palace to celebrate the king's official birthday. George smiled and waved to thousands of well-wishers as Kate made her first public appearance since announcing her cancer diagnosis earlier this year. The prince had earlier joined his mother, sister, and six-year-old brother Prince Louis in a carriage as they traveled down the mall for the traditional Trooping the Color ceremony. In May, George and his father presented the FA Cup to winners Manchester United at Wembley. Both royals shook hands with both teams as they collected their runners-up and winners medals, respectively. Full list of Weatherspoon's pubs closing by end of 2024 revealed. Passengers injured after drop tower ride falls to floor at UK theme park. Crossbow murder suspect Kyle Clifford stabbed himself in chest before arrest. Horror moment police officer is stabbed in neck by passerby in random attack. George could be seen exchanging a few words with Manchester City manager Pep Guardiola as the latter walked past. He also spoke briefly with former Manchester United manager Sir Alex Ferguson following the full-time whistle. William is president of the Football Association and a passionate Aston Villa fan, and has taken George to the club's matches on multiple occasions this year, with the young prince often sporting the team's scarf. In April, they watched Aston Villa's match against Lille in the Europa Conference League quarterfinals, their first public outing since Kate's cancer diagnosis announcement. Get in touch with our news team by emailing us at webnews at metro.co.uk. For more stories like this, check our news page. More, why Mark Cucurella is getting booed in England versus Spain Euro 2024 final. More, Keir Starmer responds to calls for bank holiday if England win Euro 2024. More, why isn't Jack Grealish playing for England at Euro 2024? Privacy policy.